It's like early days, my early days in Dundee, 1979-80, totally bored, nothing to do, pissing away all the time, strikes, you know, needed money, couldn't get a job. Decided to do something different, like run discos, put on concerts, run coaches to gigs and the Pope, stuff like that, you know, usual run of the mill stuff. And we get into all sorts of scrapes with all sorts of people, end up having to do a big gig to make all the money back that we've lost, and it's a sink or swim situation. That is shambolic in the extreme. When I first got it, I, I was, um, I felt a bit of pressure, to be honest. But then when I met Dave, it was like, you've just met Dave. So it was like, it's so relaxed and I didn't feel pressured in the slightest. He just let me work. So I, it was, it was fairly comfortable, to be honest, a lot more comfortable than I thought. All the wee pubs that we filmed in were great fun. Um, like the wee cafes as well. Like a lot of people in Dundee just let us come in and film. Do you know what I mean? Like they didn't, there wasn't like, any money involved, they were just happy to have us. Eh? So it was like, it's quite nice to sort of give back, I suppose, and, uh, and meet local people. You know what I mean? It was good fun like that, you know? It was a kind of dream to get on a big festival. Couldn't believe it when we got the call or the email. I really thought it might have been an April Fool or something, right? Seriously, I'm no joking, right? To get on the festival was like a real boost. It meant somebody had watched it, somebody must have watched it, and somebody must have said, this is okay. Well, that's awesome, like, you know, that's great. That's one person at least, or a sort of committee. So it's on it, and our name's in the heart, and we'll see what happens, you know, see where it goes. I'm from Edinburgh, um, so like, I used to go to the film house as a wee boy with my primary school and that, you know, so it's funny seeing one of my own films there. It's uh, quite nice, eh? I'm not gonna lie.